And now, race number three, it's Mason Richards, Wayne Jefferson, Garrett Dayton, and Orlando Arbesto on the Sapphire course. Hopefully, we'll get to see a good chunk of racing action for all the four competitors. Who is going to walk away with a W on the board? There's only one way to find out. Let's park this place. And it looks like any Orlando Arbesto is going to rest. Yep, so he'll be left behind in the competition for a while. Garrett Dayton trying his best to defend the lead over a couple of Silver Chow and Mason Mitchell, and he is going to rest. And right now, Wayne Jefferson possible and trying to think of a good strategy. Number two will have a command on the lead over Mason Mitchell as Wayne Jefferson, not too far behind fair place, will start on the speed rest for this base. Number two and Mason Mitchell are throwing for the lead. They approach the top of the wall, and here there goes Mason Mitchell. He wakes up immediately with speed rest number two. But Garrett Dayton still has a chance to catch up. Watch out, Mason. Garrett Dayton might steal the lead back from you. We'll see how the plan goes. Next PS belongs to number seven. He is a silver swimming type child for this race. And right now, Mason Mitchell, yep, he has defended the lead over Garrett Dayton. Garrett won't have enough distance to catch up to Mason Mitchell in time. As. Number eight, Barry Taker Spivas. You can tell you have a win on the board for Mason Richards. What a fine comeback strategy by Mason trying to get back on track. He's now up to three wins for the season. That's right, Paul. He's doing pretty well, right? He's got a win, and we have this for you.